Good afternoon, I'm Dr. Adams and I'm here to talk to you today about high blood pressure. High blood pressure is an important topic, why? Because it affects so many of us that we know and it might actually affect you. The things I wanna to talk to you about today are the types of high blood pressure, the symptoms and the treatments. This is gonna be brief, so stay tuned. Hypertension is broken down into two types, both primary and secondary. Most individuals have primary, which means we don't know why they develop it, but they do and we treat them. Secondary hypertension is hypertension caused by another medical condition. Some of the most common causes of secondary hypertension are untreated sleep apnea, diabetes, Cushing's disease, and a rare, rare form of cancer called pheochromocytoma. What are the symptoms that most of these individuals display if they have high blood pressure? Well, the majority of individuals, 90% of the time, are walking around like me and you, feeling absolutely nothing. But if you do have high blood pressure and you begin to get blurred vision, headache, chest pain, shortness of breath, numbness and tingling in your arms, or you lose consciousness, those are all very, very important reasons to go and seek medical attention right away. That doesn't mean make an appointment with your doctor for Monday, that means go to the emergency room. What are the treatments for high blood pressure? So, it all depends on why you have it. If you have high blood pressure that we don't necessarily know the answer to why you got it, then we treat it with medications. If you have high blood pressure that's caused from a second cause, like obstructive sleep apnea, we give you a CPAP machine. So it's important to know the cause of the high blood pressure and how we treat it. But in general, we treat high blood pressure with salt reduction, diet, exercise, and lastly, medications. So if your blood pressure is higher than 140 over 80, or you have any of these symptoms, seek medical care or come see me, your cardiologist. Take care.